Hello Scorpio, welcome back. Welcome back to the channel Scorpio. It's always a blessing to have you back here. Today's reading is for you. Now please make a note Scorpio that if the reading does not resonate to your present situation, please do not get hurt, offended or even in your feelings. It only simply means that the reading today is not for you. However, if you come back another day, that one just might be. Also with your first time here and your subscribe. Also, the first time here, and you have not yet subscribed to the channel, please feel free to do so and turn the post notification on Scorpio so that way you will always be the first one to be notified each and every single time that I upload a brand new video. Also, please give the videos a thumbs up because once you thumbs up the videos, YouTube will see that you like the videos and they will push those videos out into a much wider audience. The channel will grow, the video will grow. For all my returning Scorpios, please know that I love you guys so, so, so much. Thank you for the love and support that you show each and every single day. I see the love, y'all, and believe me, the love is not going unnoticed. All right, please make a note that the card has been shuffled and the card has also been blessed. But before I get into the reading, a prayer is a must. So let's get into a quick prayer and let's get into the reading. Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading. Using my body as a vessel, giving me the right words and the right messages that you want me to share with the seekers for the ones that needs to know. Heavenly Father, I give you all the honor and all the praises in Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. All right, darlings. Um, just take this reading as it comes to you. Um, the angels might want you to know about what's going on with your money, what's going on with your love life, past, present, or future. Uh, it could be even a loved one that might be trying to reach reach, reach out and connect with you, uh, want to give you a message, All right? So it could go in the reverse. It could even go for one of the cross watchers who are watching. Now, some of you do want a need, need to have a personal reading with me, all right? So the information on how to connect with me for a personal reading will be in the description part of today's video. All right, angels, let's get to work for Scorpio, please. What are the messages for Scorpio, please? Messages for Scorpio, please. Okay. So someone from the other side um, is trying to come through, um, Scorpio. They're trying to connect with you. They're saying here um, that you see them in your dreams. We are already together. Wow, look at that. Y'all have to see this. Wow. They say that you see them in your dreams. You see them in your dreams all the time. You see them in your dreams. We are already together. Together. Believe. Wow. I feel an energy that's coming through here. Oh. This energy is a very calm, soothing energy. Very, very calm. Very quiet, very, very quiet, very calm, very loving, very loving, caring energy that's coming through. Wow. This energy is saying that the all is together. You might feel like they're, they're, they're not there, um, but they're saying that they're there. They're there. They're there is what I'm, is what I'm feeling here. Hmm. This energy is also saying that they move things sometimes. They they say that they, they move things. They they you might have heard something fall. Um something about a car key, maybe. They say that they move things. They put things in different places sometimes just to get your attention. This is what I'm feeling here. They said believe, okay? They just want you to believe. Take this as it resonates to your present situation. Messages, please. Messages, please, for Scorpio, please. The intensity of this connection may stir up fear in someone. This person is a runner. All right, so I see a situation coming in here. Um, a relationship is coming in very fast, okay? It's this is a, a rapid speed here. Now, this person is 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 a kind of a energy that's letting me know that something is going on with them. Something is going on with this person. This person 
is a runner and a chaser. I think it's you're filled with fear. Your energy is filled with fear. This is very intense energy. Now listen, your person here is driving you crazy is what I'm feeling here. They're driving you crazy, okay? You, you have found yourself a runner here. You have found yourself a chaser. You have found yourself somebody that's going to give you a whole lot of stress. Okay? Believe me, sweetheart, you ain't missing out on nothing. Oh my goodness, look at that. Look at that, Scorpio. Look at that. You found yourself a runner. You found yourself someone that will drive you to the grave. All right? How many more can I say? I've proved my loyalty several times and you still doubt me. Look at that. That's your energy. You have given and given and given and you found yourself a runner. You cannot build stability with a runner or a chaser. Come on, Scorpio. Come on, Scorpio. You cannot build a, 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 an empire with someone that's always on the go. Someone that's ready to leave when, when the time get rough. Someone that doesn't like confrontation. Someone that doesn't communicate. I feel this person doesn't have time for themselves. They're a runner and a chaser. I can't give the relationship what they want from me. Your person is saying that, telling me to tell you that they cannot give the relationship what you want from them. They cannot. They cannot do it. Not right now. They cannot. They let me know. Please tell them. Please tell them. I can't do it. I cannot give the relationship what they're desiring from me right now. Give me a reason to come back to return. Your person isn't there. They're not there. They are MIA. Missing an action here. Missing an action. Give me a reason to come back to return. Hmm. You're, you're supported by divine energy to receive love. Angels are saying, Scorpio, know that you are supported by divine energy. To receive love. You are supported by divine energy to receive love. Can we reverse? Can we go back? Do you remember your first card that showed up, Scorpio? Do you remember your very first card in the beginning of this reading? If you've forgotten, let me remind you. This was your very first card. Believe. And let me remind you what someone had said and wanted you just wanted to share wanted to share this with you. Someone from the other side said you see them in your dreams. You are always to we are always together. They are protecting you. But you have to believe. That word believe, it means believe in yourself. Believe that you are worthy. Believe that you have a purpose in this world. Believe that you deserve nothing but the best. Believe that you are a child of God. Believe that you are filled with divine power. Believe. That you can move mountains to Christ who strengthen you, honey. Believe that you are never going to settle for a runner. Believe that you are never going to settle for a chaser. Believe in the higher power. And that is the power of God. You're never going to build stability with a person who doesn't have a sense of direction. And this person that you are hoping for, this person is a runner and this person is a chaser. Believe. Believe in yourself. Angels are saying that you need to know this as well. Just the two of us. You and God. Okay? Just the two of you. You need to find your way back to worshiping and find your way back 
to the place where you used to be before you felt the way you're feeling right now. You and your God. And let him direct your path. You've been in the desert for too long, wasting time, going without water. Okay? Angels are saying, my darlings, you have traded a diamond for a rock. And just saying that you have traded a diamond for a rock. You have traded a diamond for a rock. Is what you have done. And just just saying that you might have caught them spying on someone else. You might have caught caught them do, being with someone else, doing something that they shouldn't have done with something that, with someone else. But guess what? You have found yourself a runner and you have found yourself a chaser. Okay? Hmm. Don't judge me for how I treat this relationship. They obviously likes it if they are still around. Your person, energy, is coming towards me, attacking me for sharing this message with you. But let me tell you something. Your person cannot conquer me, okay? They cannot conquer me. Your person energy will never win. They can never win, okay? Your person just told me. Remember I told you your person had an energy that was just like very uh like an angry i feel that person may be possessed your person may be possessed they, poss they probably were possessed as, ch as a child okay they have a very evil energy towards them temper anger but it can't come now by dwelling we'll send that energy back to where it belongs in the name of jesus it is not going to work with me. Uh-uh. Your person is telling me. Don't judge me for how I treat this relationship. They obviously likes it if they are still around. Honey. Look at that. Look at that. That is your person energy. All right? But I'm going to send that energy right back to the pit of hell where it belongs because it will not come near my dwelling. In the name of, name of Jesus, I bind you up. I bind you up, unclean spirit. I bind you up and send you right back to the pit where you belong. You can't. I don't fear you. I don't fear you. No way, shape, or form. In the name of Jesus, I is God who compel you to go back to that pit with that tone. Don't use that tone with me. I'm not afraid of you. And never will be. Believe me, sweetheart, you ain't missing out on nothing. Angels are saying it once again. You remember they said it before? I'm going to remind you that angels already said this to you. This was your very second card. Look at this. Look at that, y'all. The angels have spoken again. Twice. They said you need to hear this. Two times. You remember that two times? Look at this. You remember that two times? Two times they said. Just the two of us. That was two, right? And this is number two. The same message two times. Scorpio, it is time that you take back your control, okay? It is time. That is your reading for today, my darlings. I hope it did resonate with you. Please remember to pray, y'all, because listen, prayer works all the time. All the time. 
You cannot pray today and not pray tomorrow. And then you pray second, third day, and then you skip the fourth day. And then you go to church on Sundays and forget about Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. It doesn't work that way. You have to pray every single day, all day, every day for the rest of your life. That is how you keep relationships like these away from your front door from away from your heart and from away from your body because when you when you take in all these negative uh energies inside your body okay there will be a reflection of you nothing will come to the surface nothing will manifest in your life when you have these negative energy in your life your person's energy is not a good one okay it's time that you step it is time that you start cleaning yourself, all right? Start drinking your water, okay? Drink your water. Drink room temperature water. Don't drink the water from the refrigerator, y'all. Drink room temperature water. And when you drink, when you open a bottle of water like this, you pray over that bottle of water. And just ask God to have the water become consecrated water, y'all. And drink it. Water is uh, cleansing. Water is nourishment to your soul mentally. Start drinking your water. Only water that is room temperature water. And pray over that water before you drink it. And let that water become consecrated water. And clean, cleanse your body from the inside. Alright? I hope that did help someone, okay? Um, don't forget to pray like I said before. And with that said, always remember to seek first and you will always find.